What's up guys, Grim here. You guys are not going to believe this story. So many stories are coming out of this Pokemon Go stuff. It is unbelievable. Recently there was an Uber driver named Alex Ramirez that would live stream Pokemon Go gameplay while he was waiting on the next call to come in to transport somebody with his Uber service. It seems he was working in the nighttime, so he was taking a break going by the church which was a Pokestop apparently and chilling out there and live streaming to everybody that was watching. While there a black truck pulls up and Alex witnesses a murder my car has 90 what the fuck why is there a random truck here at the church is this motherfucker playing Pokemon too oh my god <gasps> oh my god holy shit oh god this guy just killed this ch oh fucking shit holy shit this guy just killed it oh my god oh my god i just witnessed a fucking murder i just witnessed a fucking murder oh my god 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 after he seen what happened he tried to drive away in the black truck happened to be following him afterwards oh my god oh is he fucking chasing me oh my god he's fucking chasing me dude oh my god fuck oh my god 911 how do you call 911? How do you dial 911? Fucking shit. Oh, oh my god. 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 Hello? 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 Yes, yes. I just this guy fucking dumped the body at the church. I don't know what church. I was playing Pokémon and I went over there cuz I thought he was going to uh he was like going to catch a Pokémon and he's following me right now. I'm on North Street. I'm on North Street. North Street. I don't know. Track me. I'm on YouTube right now. Pokemon. I don't know where I'm going. He's behind me. He's behind me in a truck, a black truck. Alex. My name is Alex. My name is Alex. My name is Alex. Alex Ramirez. My number. I can't give you my number. People are watching me right now. I'm going to go. I'm going to go to the Sonic. I'm going to go to the Sonic. I'm going to go to the Sonic. The Sonic on Calder. The Sonic on Calder. The guy's following me. The guy's following me. Following me. He freaking killed. Okay. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. He killed. Okay, listen. I play Pokemon Pikachu. You gonna you know Pokemon? Okay, listen. It's a game. It's a game. I went to this church. I'm. No, I didn't kill nobody. It wasn't me. No, no. Listen, I, I'm streaming right now, so I have proof. No, I went to this church. I went to this church to get some Pokeballs because I ran out of Pokeballs, and I see a, a random truck, and I'm like, oh, what the? F what is this truck doing? It's cat. What is this guy playing Pokemon too? So I was gonna be like, oh cool, another guy is playing Pokemon. Cause why would you be at a church at freaking two in the morning, right? Behind the church. Cause the thing is behind the church. And then I see a freaking body drop on the passenger side. And I'm like, holy shit, this guy is dropping a body. I turn around, he's following me right now. In a black truck. A Silverado. Fucking Chevy Sil sorry, Chevy, Chevy Silverado. Chevy Silverado. Chevy Silver. Oh my god, fuck me. I don't know where I'm going. I'm scared. I'm just driving. He ends up cutting off the live stream so that he can call 911 and be able to give his phone number where the live stream is not going to be able to hear it. Everyone was speculating what happened to him because we didn't know if the black truck actually caught him or what happened. The next day Alex got back on live stream and let everybody know that he was okay but there was a turn of events. Just like everything on the internet people tried to say and do things in order to bring you down and these people happened to call his employer or else the Uber service in general and report him over and over to where they actually removed him from the program so not only did this guy go through a traumatic experience of witnessing a murder but then he lost his job afterwards there is a little bit of a happy ending and there was several large youtubers and live streamers that set up a gofundme for him alex has been receiving many donations through the gofundme which is going to help him a lot last off alex's youtube channel was a very small channel and now it has over a hundred thousand subscribers at a time when the people of the internet caused him to lose his job they turn around and fund him on the gofundme and try to help him get his life back it's always nice whenever the internet actually does good things the story seems to end pretty well right wrong we got scammed there was a lot of speculation that this whole thing was a hoax so lots of people are calling the police station where this supposedly happened in all of the instances the police are saying that this is not true they're saying this guy did this for subscribers on youtube and also views on his live stream nobody was recovered no call was placed the uber service is even being contacted and they say they let him go because of low ratings in the 
the end, this is just another instance of people trying to scam the system. That's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to smash that like button. As usual, my name is Grim, and I'll see you next time.